There are almost 14 billion rats on Earth, but only the most cunning and hardy species can survive in urban environments. Most people consider rats to be dangerous, malicious, and absolutely useless animals. The Yeter. rat, or sewer rat, is the most common rodent on Earth. They originated in FIFA 19. Oh! Oh, shit! A rat! You don't want to be like this. This is disgusting. This is awful in every way. If I could kill it, I would. I have an idea. Hello, Bozo. Why? Why would you do that? Why would you do any of that? Bored. Someone called 9-1, holy shit! That's what I like! Man, this is like kinda good. Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? Shocking, dreadful, no quality. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need it! You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast and reliable coins. You can use the link in the description, use code Magell and get a 6% discount. And to celebrate team of season with u7buy, you can claim rewards by collecting the letters T-O-T-S. Alright boys and girls, today is going to be a very, very cheeky day, okay? Well, actually, then I say that, it might actually not be a cheeky day, okay? Today, boys, we are becoming a bit of a meta rat. And what I mean by that, lads, is that I've picked up the team of the season rat today, okay? I've picked up Ben Yedder. You were the chosen one! It was said that you would destroy it! Meta. Not join them! I know, lads, that's disgusting behaviour from me, okay? I feel a little bit guilty, but I just kind of, like, I'm curious, right? I want to see what this card is all about, okay? I barely ever use Ben Yedder, so I'm just very curious. Some of you guys are probably like wondering like Michelle how have you got the money for this card because he's definitely not a cheap guy the only reason I was able to afford this card lads is that I actually sold my Dave for a big profit okay the last episode we picked up Jonathan David's team a season for about 640k by the time I got around to selling him he'd actually gone up by like 200k so I sold him for like 850 so I, I had like a lot more money than I had before normally it goes the other way you know like I remember when I picked up team season Kolo Mawani for like 200k by the time I got around to selling him he was like 100k so yeah I had a quite bit of money lads and I was just going through the team of seasons and I saw Ben Yedder and I just thought you know what? I'm going to give him a try, okay? I want to see what this card is all about. All right, then, boys. So, we've thrown him into a very, very cheeky team, okay? I'm pretty happy with this team because there's a lot of cool cards in there. I mean, the first card I do want to highlight, lads, is this red toddy bow that I did get for my red picks. He's not a super expensive card, lads. So, it's, you know, it's not the craziest red card I've ever got, but he does look pretty nice. I also did get this team of season for Fauna, lads, that I've not thrown in this team because I think I might review him in a couple of days. But yeah, another really nice card here, lads. And uh, yeah, there's some really good stats on this guy. So, in the midfield, lads, I went with this team of season Andre card, okay? And overall, he's really good defensively. Attack not so much, you know, with a three star, three star, and a terrible shooting. I taste shit. But yeah, it does look like a pretty decent card, lads, and he was super, super cheap. We've got the bald head in here, of course, lads. We've got Colin Mawani, who I absolutely love. And then up top, we got a Pender and Ben Yedder, which could be the filthiest little front two ever. All right, then, boys, let's take a look at the in games of the rat, okay? So starting off, we've got five foot seven, high low work race, four star, five star. Now, I hate to admit it, lads, but that is a hell of a start, okay? I mean, the five foot seven is obviously going to make the dribbling really good. The high low work rate turns me on a bit. Plus that five star weak foot, so yeah, that, that's a pretty good start. So yeah, we've got 92 pace here, lads, which honestly, I, I, I honestly think that's kind of low. Like, I expected Ben Yedder to have at least, like, 95 pace. So, I won't lie, lads, the pace is actually quite surprising. But, uh, it's definitely not bad. I just expected it to be more. And the shooting, though, lads, is, uh, a lot better, okay? You've got 99 attack positioning there, 97 finishing, 94 shot power. So, the shooting is pretty ridiculous. Passing as well, lads, is absolutely fantastic, okay? You could definitely play this card as a cam if you wanted. And then we got the dribbling, lads, and, uh, Jesus fucking Christ. I mean, that's borderline perfect. He's got 99 agility and balance there. He's got 97 in-game dribbling, 99 ball control. The dribbling is just disgusting. He's got 95 heading accuracy see here lads which is pretty good i mean it's really good but unfortunately he's only five at seven so i don't think we're going to be winning too many headers today and then the physical stats that are actually not bad for ben yedder again considering the guy is five for seven to have 80 physical is definitely not bad that's actually pretty good and then the cherry on top with this card lads is definitely the traits okay you got flare trait and outside of foot traces and really nice traits there so yeah overall boys and girls i hate to admit it this card looks pretty damn good okay there's some really good stats on this guy he's got the five star weak foot as well like he's gonna be good i already know it but in the back of my mind i'm just kind of hoping that he's not good okay because it's Ben Yedder, you know, I don't want Ben Yedder the rat to be good. Alright then boys, enough wasting time, okay, we'll jump straight into things, okay, hopefully get some wins today, get some goals, all that good stuff. Alright then boys, join us to game number one. <laughs> oh, Pender, he's won it back, because he's filthy. One more! Ben Yedder, you got to score. Ben Yedder, you, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of glad you missed it, because it means you're shit, but you really should score that. Over top it. Come on, come on, Rat Yedder. 
He's done really well. Can he bury it? No, he can. For fuck's sake, Ben Yedder. Why can't you be shit? He was shit a minute ago when he didn't put it in the net. Why can't he have been shit again? Joe Cole, he's done really well, to be honest. He's played a great pass. Oh, what a cross. And a pet. Okay, I was going to fucking say, if I didn't score there, that would have been scripting. No, fuck off. Oh, what my God. Get rid of it. Okay, we, we got away with that. Great pass into Ben Yedda. He's making a good run as well. I'm going to play him through. He's probably going to get a goal here, isn't he? Oh, my God. That's just... Uh, the fact that he even got on the end of it, like, with that fucking shit touch and still put it in, it just... You can tell that he's just broken. I hate to say it. It was kind of cool. Oh, shit. No. Oh, all right, Michelle. Everyone stay calm, boys, okay? It's it's only free. We're still winning, but... Oh, my God. You just know it, though. You know that the comeback is coming. Oh, he's been away. And a player pender. Right, ref. Uh, excuse me? All right, let's go. Good options here, boys. We'll play Mooney, yeah? And then cross it. Oh, that's a good cross. Oh, right, keeper, how have you saved? That's that's a joke of a save. Now, who is this? I'm getting... LaCroix is getting toasted. You No, okay, no, never mind. That touch was terrible. Shit. Oh, please. Head it, head it, head it. Oh, fuck. Oh, what a save, Donnarumma. I thought for sure that was a guaranteed goal, man. I got, I got away with that. Please head it. I'm getting, I'm getting away with murder here, boys. What is going on? I didn't play it. Oh, and he's onside as well. But it's Andre, and Andre has terrible shooting. Oh, you just know, you knew it was going to be a dead shot. Listen, I've had enough of your shit. Great pass to Kola Mwani. Come on, boys. We've got to put this game to bed. A great pass. And Ben Yedder's put it away for the hat trick, boys. That should be job done. I shouldn't be bottling it now because this guy was getting back in the game. and He was all over me for a few minutes. But that should be it, boys. I, again, I shouldn't be bottling it now. Oh my fucking god, Colour Mawani, that's an effort. And that is the end of that one, boys and girls. That's a brilliant win from the boys, okay? That could have been very, very different had a few chances gone in for this guy. We did get away with it a couple of times, okay? We did escape with a nice little win, okay? 4-1 win. It was definitely closer than what the scoreline suggested. But yeah, I'll definitely take a 4 goal dance there, boys. Good stuff. <laughs>good goal like I can't oh it's Capri Vega he was good when I used him the other day but yeah I can't complain to that boys that, that just was a pretty nice goal okay Joko's making a good run so it's Colo Mawani I'm gonna play it and then cross it quickly Colo oh Colo no oh he's offside anyway that would have been such a nice goal I like it yeah and then through oh my god please be onside because that's a belting pass Oh, he's buried it, boys. I, I hate to admit it, but Ben Yedder is actually pretty... He's pretty fucking good, isn't he? Like, he just is. You able to stop it? Nope. What the... F what the hell? That's what the fuck happened there? Did he rage quit? He couldn't have raged. It's only 1-0. No. Like, no, no one rage quit to 1-0. No. No, that's, that's weird. I can't imagine he would have rage quit himself. I think we must have just disconnected there, lads. So, uh, yeah, I mean, there's not much you can do really do about that one. All right, then, boys. I guess we're jumping to game number three. Shit me, man. I've got to deal with Haaland and Alawarian. And I fucked it. Of course I fucked it. And a red. That's not a red card, EA. I'm not being funny. It wasn't that bad a tackle. I was, I was this close to getting a fucking ball. And he has scored. It's I'm one nil down with a red card in 10 minutes. It couldn't be much worse than that. No. Oh my god. No, no, no. Why does that not go in? That. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, Todd you need to, you need to go to jumping school because that is shocking. How does that go over your head, man? That was the worst jump I've ever seen. Okay, Rat Yadda, Vanessi. Oh my god. Oh, fuck me. He's good. Like, he's good, boys. Like, he's actually really good. I don't like admitting it because, I mean, it's, it's Rat Yedda, you know? You don't want Rat Yedda to be good, especially when you come up against him. But uh, he's good, boys. I hate to inform you. 
Oh, that was a good pass. <sighs> this Haaland, man, he, he is dicking the shit out of me. We, we could have a problem here. I feel like the scoreline could get really bad, boys. Like, if Benya didn't score earlier, like that absolutely freakish long shot, then it would be 3 0 to this guy. I, I just don't. I don't have a good feeling about this one, boy. I think we're going to lose. Fucking hell, Haaland. He's got another chance again. Donnarumma. Right now, hold on a minute, Donnarumma. That has to be scripting, boys. Watch this. No, don't fucking skip it. That is the worst goalkeeping display I've ever seen. They could have caught that so easily, and he just stood there, and they thought, I should probably catch that, shouldn't I? And it just parried into his own net. I'm fucking believable. Oh, fucking up, Todibo. You have been terrible against Haaland. Like, he sent you into another dimension. Look at it. He's getting bullied. That's on side. How the fuck is that on side? Please head that. All right, do you know, do you know what, do you know what? Fuck it, boys. I, I, I I've lost the game. Like I, I can't beat this. This guy is too fucking good. He is dicking the shit out of me with Harland. I can't take it anymore. The application is closed, boys, because I'm gonna keep that red card. I, I just moving on to game number four. Actually, you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Oh, yeah, play it. Oh, that's a great bit of play. Ben Yedda. Well, that's a good start, boys and girls. Two minutes in. That's a that's a hell of a goal there. That Guerrero did ridiculously well for that assist, by the way. Oh, bold. He's done well. Colo, keep running, lad. Colo! What? Van der Sar, fuck off. You save that. Oh, Colo Mawani's nabbed it. And he slammed it home. What a finish, Colo. You cheeky little fucker. Fantastic tackle, and it's created a little counter attack here. I think Rat Yedder's on side. He's played a great pass. Oh, Joe Cole. That is a goal and a half from Joe Cole, boys. He's had two defenders on his ass there. And we've managed to get the lad to rage quit, boys. What a wonderful end to this episode, okay? And I needed that after that last game where we got absolutely humiliated. So, yeah, we end things that's with a nice little clean sheet dance. I'll definitely take that. Hey, you get it. All right, then, boys and girls, let's talk about the rat, okay, and how I feel about him. Overall, like, I've got to admit it, he's he's freaking good, lads, okay? He's he's really good. And this guy's dribbling, lads, is honestly on another planet. Like, he's one of the best dribblers I've used in this game easily. Like, he just floats with the ball, okay? You can't tackle him when he's on it. And his shooting, of course, lads, is absolutely fantastic, okay? His finishing inside of the box with both left foot and right foot are incredible. He's really good at long shots as well. There's genuinely nothing he's really bad at, lads. You know, his passing was good. Physically wasn't too bad, you know, considering he's five foot seven. He was just literally good at it everything you can do. So I even thought his pace was even better than it suggested on the card. You know, 92 pace, like, it's still good, but he just felt blisteringly quick. See, so, yeah, I hate to admit it, lads, but the rat is once again broken, okay? I mean, you, you kind of expect it because it's Ben Yedda and he's always going to be broken every year. But, yeah, I was just kind of crossing my fingers and hoping that he was just somehow going to be shit, you know, because it would be nice if I could go into fuck champs and not have to play this card and get dicked by him. Unfortunately, no, that's not going to be the case, okay? This card is going to continue to dick us year after year. See, so, yeah, I'm going to run a pretty cheeky mirror, lads. I'm going to give him a 1 out of 10. Know your fucking place, trash. So yeah, I'm gonna wrap the episode up there. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, smash that subscribe. I'll see you guys next one. All right, peace.